When people ask you what you do for a living, and then they ask you what's the most fun part of your job, what's the most fun part of your job? Um, being a convener at the end of the day. Um, I, most people will look at me and say, so you just do social media, right? Uh, which is true, I do social media, but social media is a really interesting trigger and bottleneck from the rest of the organization out to a, a, the public facing reputation of AARP, which means that on any given day, I'm bringing people together from our brand department, our content team, media buying agencies, creative agencies, community management agencies, um, all the way down to our research folks and our public policy institute, uh, because everybody has to come together in kind of a perfect harmony uh, in order for our social channels to really sing on behalf of the brand. You've spoken about content. It's one of your passions. Absolutely. Why is it one of your passions, especially in the context of mobile? I think that content allows brands to present themselves in really authentic and deeply connective ways. Um, mobile just happens to be where our audience is at, and that should not be surprising for anyone looking at the demographics right now. But you know, the majority of our Facebook audience is coming to us from mobile. Even our, the majority of our Twitter audience is coming from mobile as well. It now, makes... when you say mobile, especially for your audience of the American Associations of Retired People, yes. yes, are we talking more tablets and iPads? Are we talking handhelds, or is it actually smartphones? It's a mix. It, it is predominantly smartphones, but I wouldn't discount the numbers against tablets See, I, as well. Interesting enough, I thought it would be the exact opposite. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, I thought it would be, you know, seventy percent iPads and tablets, and the rest smartphones? Um, I think you have to think about the type of content that folks are going to be consuming from AARP. Right. Um, so if folks want to read AARP the magazine um, digitally, they're probably going to pick up their tablet and they're going to read our uh, tablet version of AARP the magazine or AARP the bulletin. But if people are wanting to, you know, I don't think folks are generally ever coming to us through Facebook really jonesing for uh, financial tips or health advice. Um, but that's, they're on a smartphone looking at Facebook because they want to engage with their friends and their family or they're on Twitter engaging with a community of interest. Um, it's our responsibility to find the natural integration points and the points where we can tell a dynamic story that's really relevant to someone on each of these platforms. And that's how we show up and that's how we create content so that it's custom to Facebook and the audience on Facebook. It's custom to Twitter and the audience on Twitter. Um, and then hoping that we can, you know, either through organic interest or through paid push, we can, we can really serve that content up to those folks in that moment. Do you feel like that if you're going to do mobile marketing, you're really you're doing content marketing and oh by the way it's on mobile? Absolutely, yeah. Talk to me more about that. Um, it, again, we focus on, what our team focuses on primarily is communities of interest, creating content for communities of interest. So we're trying to focus on a quality of engagement um, and we're focusing on small communities. You know, one of the, the analytics that came out of this piece of content, the Harrier Jet video, was that uh, nine, I think like 95% of our views were from men. Um, and our chief of staff to our CMO said, can we get like one for women next time? And I said, the great thing about this model is that you get a car and you get a car and you get a car. So point me in the direction of an audience. We'll do the deep dive. We'll find the right strategy to reach that audience. We'll find out where they are. If that audience isn't on our social channels or they're not consuming in uh, video content in a way that's conducive to us reaching them, i.e. they're not on mobile, everybody's on mobile, um, then we'll, we'll pass on that audience. You know, we really want to be strategic about putting the right message to the right person on the right channel. Um, I have this conversation with my team of strategists all the time. Not every business objective is going to be met through social or mobile or through content. Uh, not every audience can be reached uh, in the channels and the types of content that we have at our disposal, and it's okay. Um, you know, we don't do a check the box strategy anymore. We really want to be very targeted with our resources and our time and making sure that we're not pummeling our audiences with too much information about ARP when they're not really ready for it.